Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Down Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite. And Jonas, I just ripped my jeans. I just, I've watched you do it. I was like, what the hell are you doing? Right These now? are the jeans I lost my virginity in. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the ones with the pockets? We talked about them recently. Yeah, these are the pocket jeans, dude. dude they Look, are I like... just ripped all. Oh, all wow. Freaking I got a sewing kit. You want to sew them up? No, I'm not going to sew them up. They don't even have pockets. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we are playing Madden 20. We're doing the Chiefs. <laughs> wow, dude. I saw like the, the horror. This, I was just trying to take this I part saw off. the horror in your eyes as you did it, too. Oh, like you just sucks. like you got all big eyed and ish. Like, yeah, actually, I might sew them up now because I got the part off that I wanted off. For right, you. dude. I got a, I got some needle and thread. You can make it. I know how to it, sew, too. I did, that's, that's, yeah, dude. We had to take home back in high school. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. They I know how have, to sew. They don't do that. anymore. They didn't teach us how to cook, did they? Do you remember that? Did we they, teach Cook? We had we made like cookies and I think we made like rolls or but something. But it wasn't like the whole. It was like a part of the class, right? Yeah. Yeah, because like, we had to watch sewing yeah. more than. Yeah, else. I remember like we got to like make a pillow. Yeah. Well, see, we made pillows. Did you get to make the bear? We made two different pillows. We didn't make a bear. No. We made like we made like a cheat pillow that was like um, it was like just like basically like two pieces of uh. A two squares and you sewed around stuffed it and then finished it off okay and then we made a, a pillow that was um it was like four like panels kind of like an orange peel mm. and, then, and then we sewed them together or whatever like you know patch, what I'm talking about like a patchwork boy kind of but it was like yeah it was like four it was like four like it was like a football see i remember making a pillow but i also remember them giving us this bear and it was like a kit and you had the my bear did not turn out well. Yeah, I don't think anybody's did because we were trash. Yeah, is it is it weird that I still remember to this day how to do a back stitch and a cross stitch? I still know how to sew, dude. I like sew. If I have like a hole in my shirt and my in my like, if I like tear a crotch a hole in the crotch or my armpit or something, I sew that ish up, dude. <laughs> Whenever I tear a crotch, I like. To sew. <laughs> if I ever tear my crotch, up, I gotta like tear the crotch and then I can sew it up. You know what I mean? <laughs> I mean, I don't know if that's talent or horrifying. <laughs> yeah, it's both. <laughs> a little bit of both, huh? Yeah, right. You're like, I didn't mean to do that, girl. Sorry. <laughs> oh wait, I thought we were talking about your own crotch. <laughs> oh, oops. There I go again. <laughs> what are you doing? You said tear a crotch. I had a different uh -huh. thought. Uh-huh. Mine constantly in the waste paper oh, basket. Oh, dude, that's th welcome to my life. Waste paper yeah. basket. Yeah, dude. So, when was the last time you had to sew something besides those pants you brought to sew later today? <laughs> when is the last time I had? I don't know. Never, dude. I don't sew anymore. I, uh, what Jonas, is this? I'm affluent now. I just throw ish out when it gets ripped. What's now. the... Yeah, what did I do last time I had to sew something? Or I just roll with the hole. Roll with the hole. Yeah, dude. I just Hashtag roll with, roll with the hole. Yeah, dude. If I get it, like I have, I have a pair of scrubs that has had a hole in the crotch for like I don't know, five years. I'm just like, you, yo, you're gonna end up bending over too fast and just ripping them boys <laughs> out. <laughs> you know, you see that, and that's the cliche. I swear, I've not had that happen to me in in years. That it's, happened to me one time with a pair of pants. I knew there was a hole in the crotch, and I stooped down, like, really fast, and okay. I just split the whole crotch out. I was like, oh, God, I forgot that was the pair. All right, never mind. That happened to me, like, last year. <laughs> <laughs> it isn't so much the bending over. It's the stooping down that gets yeah, you. Yeah, like, you do, like, the spread. Yeah, you super squat spread. drop. Yep, exactly. Like, yeah, it's like you're dro doing a teabag bag on someone. <laughs> I've never done a real-life tea bag. Have you ever done a real-life tea bag? I don't tea think bag? so. We know someone who did it who's done tens of thousands of them. I don't think I ever did one. No, there's a difference between the nut drop. I've done the nut drop. That's different. Oh, the actual, like, flesh on flesh? No! What the hell, What's the difference? Bro? What's the difference between a nut drop and a tea bag, then? The nut drop is when, like, your friend is playing video games and he's sitting on the floor, and then you walk up behind him in fully clothed, Usually wearing loose fitting clothing, sweatpants or shorts would help with right. this. Yeah. And you just take your balls <laughs> and you just like set them on his shoulder. <laughs> That's the nut drop. That is something that a person we both know did that tr so many times. <laughs> yeah, well, that's not a tea bag. Necessary. What is the actual tea? Oh, look at fancy pants to do here. <laughs> not disgusting. What is a tea <laughs> bag? Urban dictionary. But like, effort. what's the difference? Like, right, I mean, so, without saying what it is, like, is it like flesh? Yeah, so a tea bag is exactly what it sounds like. You take your in a mouth. Yeah. Oh, you're like, yeah, you're like washing the uh, dog. You're washing the washing the golf ball. Yes, it's kind of like washing golf balls. Gotcha. 
Hell's I mean, my favorite part of this. going golfing. I asked for this. Watching the balls. I love watching the balls. Yeah, I bet you do. Yeah, dude. I gotta keep them boys clean, dude. <laughs> you use a special type of detergent? I use a special brush. Oh, you fumbled! Oh, my goodness! A special brush. <laughs> I, got a, I got a ball brush. A no, ball really. brush? That would no. be nice, actually. Would with, like, some nice, like, horsehair bristles. You know what's fun? Oh, God, that would not be nice. No. Horsehair on horsehair on your ball. Yeah. Um, no, dude, I actually bought... I was at uh, Marshall's or TJ Maxx or one of those, like, discount dude. stores. Mm. And they had a loofah on a stick. Like, yeah. it was... It's, like, for... Uh, and, like... It, for it's, getting your back? Yeah, for, like, your back. And I was like, oh, man, maybe this would be really good on, like, my uh, my friends. And, like, it, it wasn't as great as oh, I thought it would. Yeah, dude. On the girls. They're not the girls. They're the guys. They're mine are the girls. Yeah. <laughs> I've always called them the girls. Have you? Yeah. Was that a problem? You can call them whatever you want. Thank you can call you. them the hyenas if you want. I've always thought that, honestly, when it comes to the uh, the male physique, that those are more feminine than that. This is really sounding weird. Yeah, it is but sounding there's a weird, point. dude. There's Absolutely. a point. I've always considered them more feminine than I would masculine because... I don't protect my uh, my personage personage like I would a son. I protect it like a daughter. Oh, I see. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're not strong in a fight. In no, fact, you hit them in a fight, they're gonna run for cover, and I have to defend. And you know? like, but it also hurts you when they get hurt. Exactly. Like if someone punched your daughter in the face, it would hurt you. Yes. Punched it in would the hurt face. me physically to the point where I feel like I have to do something. If I see my son get into a fight, I'm like, hey, man, you better go ahead and fight your battle. <laughs> I'm not going to say that to the girls. Right, right, right. I'm not going to tell the girls to do that. I'm going to kick your A. And like, oh, they can't take a hit. Um, they're good in the kitchen. Wow, dude, you're getting really <laughs> sexist. What? I'm talking about How are your life? balls good in the kitchen? You're comparing them to women, though. <laughs> well, you ever ate any of my cooking? I have then you Now you know who I to know thank. I had, I had some of your cooking, then dude. You, yeah, you, dude. Now you know who to thank. It's <laughs> <laughs> my secret. You're channeling it straight from your estrogen-filled balls. <laughs> <laughs> my secret ingredient. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Where? Oh man! Uh, yeah, dude. Sorry for coughing, dude. I swear it was. Uh, I swear it's not not things. Just a tickle in the yeah, throat, yeah, dude. Yeah. <coughs> oh yeah, man. I uh, God. So, what yeah. was the last thing I sewed? So yeah, I do I do call them the girls. I have done that for. It, it, it's funny too, man. But I am. Yeah, I mean, it's cool. I'm hetero, dude. I swear. Nice. If you're not, that's fine too. Yeah. I mean, I don't mind, dude. I don't. I let you let you do whatever you nah, want. You're allowed. Look, yeah, and like I feel you, and I respect that. But I'm going to tell you right now, Jonas, if you just, like, started bringing home dudes, we we got to have a talk, all really? right? Really? Like, you couldn't be my friend anymore? I'm not so, wait, whoa, you took it to a whole nother level. Why do we have to have a talk about my we're, sexuality? We're going to have a talk. We're going At to. At least just be like, oh, you're doing dudes now? Is that how the talk's going to no, go? No, that's not what the talk is, is going to be. Is that what's hot in the streets, dude? It's guys? not like I'm going to see you walk through the door kissing some wayfish boy. <laughs> wait, why's he got to be a boy? Now I have other problems? <laughs> I mean... Man... Eat, yes, Adult males, whatever. Fine. I'm not gonna see you walking in, kissing some wayfish boy. You two like go in, taking your cardigans off as you <laughs> as you go into your room. You come out with like this red uh, smoking jacket and a cigar, and I'm not gonna ask any questions. All right. <laughs> it's like normal Tuesday for Travis. Yeah. It's not. <laughs> it's not like I'm gonna be like, hey, dude, this is a problem. I'm moving out. No, I'm gonna be like, oh, so you were just like you were unsure for. 30 years? Oh, just like it's like a friend to friend. Like, yeah. I've known you a long time. I never thought that this was what you were into, and all of a sudden, this is what you're into? Yeah, I feel like, honestly, a change to that much of a drastic. I just want to check your mental statehood, all right? Like, you just make sure I'm not going through a phase? Yeah. Like, are you all right? Like, you feel like this is what you need to do to, like. Yeah. I got, oh, you're more looking out for me than a. Yes, uh, because if I, like, sit you down and then you start talking about, like, Ninja Turtles, I'm going to be like, all right, he needs help. Oh, I, uh, oh, I got. <laughs> So I'm not like just on a uh, self-destructive path, yeah. and just like I'm just like, what am I gonna do? I know what I'll do. Just change everything. Yeah, I started doing heroin too. I'm like, see, right? Okay, I got you. Okay, see, it's Jonas. more like a, a wellness check yeah. than a uh, <laughs> than a judgment call. Than a straight check. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> straight check, Jonas. Let me smell your dick. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Better not smell like what I think it smells Better like. Not sm- <laughs> <laughs> Better not smell like Axe body spray. Cause that's a problem. Oh, we didn't get the touchdown. We're down by nine at halftime. That's not good. <laughs> nah, that's unfortunate. 
Yeah, man. Uh, so yeah, uh, yeah. When was know. the last time you used Axe body spray? <laughs> I never have used. Axe you body never spray. ever, even like when we were younger when it I first mean, came out. Okay, all right, maybe then. I moved up into the uh, what do you call that? Who's who's the Old Spice body spray? Oh, okay. I've always been an Old Spice boy. Though. Yeah, me too. I use Old Spice deodorant since I was like, ever since I needed to buy deodorant, it's been Old Spice. Do you use the stick or do you use the gel? I use... You a it, gel or not, a stick boy? It's not the loose gel. Like It's not like you twist it and it spurts up through the oh, holes. Oh, the freaking collagen? Yeah, it's not, it's not <laughs> that. But I don't use the, I don't use the white-based. I use the... It's like a blue gel, but it's a solid. Okay, so yeah, that's... I, think. I guess solid as a gel can be, you know, but it's not that, you know, it's not that. I, you know what? I lied. I used to use when I was like, when I first started using deodorant, oh. I did use like, it was like Gillette and you twisted it and it like oh. came up and it would go on wet. And if you put your shirt on too soon, it would like cake oh. on the arm. I'm like, what? Then I was Dude. like, no, no, can't yeah. do that anymore. Yeah, that, that is just gross, man. Like, do they even make that? Does anyone use that anymore? I don't know, man. I don't know who thought it was a good idea for me to put cerebral spinal fluid on my like, freaking put armpits. Like gelatin in your armpits. It's like, so you, gross. Like, and it's like, who has 40 seconds or two minutes? It's probably more than 40 seconds. Like, that gel has to dry. Like, if you mm -hmm. put the shirt on, to, it, like, gets on your sleeve. It, like, mm -hmm. it, and then it basically wastes the whole putting on process. <laughs> it gets on your sleeve. It always ends I up, know. like, down your flank. Right. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. But, if you, it, but I also run into, if I use the white kind, like the chalky, yeah. it, like, ends up, like, af, af, not the first time, but if I wear a shirt for, like, you know, say I have a shirt for a few you know, months or whatever. Oh yeah. It'll get like a hard like Oh yeah. yeah it gets like hard and then and then oh, the armpit yeah, like oh, breaks yeah. down and there's a hole and you can't even sew that ish because it's like it's hard as fuck. I'm like oh. <laughs> <laughs> passionate passion dude. Passion swear. <laughs> dude, I, was, passion I was like really speaking from the heart about that one. <laughs> So, All right, so Jonas, look, uh, we we have the same ideals when it comes to putting uh, the uh, the the super gel, like the just like throwing yeah, dude. The, the collagen or your aerosol. Arm. Uh uh, aerosol is also bad too. But I am a stick boy. I like, like the white stick. Oh yeah. Okay. Because I want I want my I want my sh to be clogged up. I feel like that's just like putting like tar over the blacktop. Yeah, but like, doesn't that ruin your shirts? I mean, some of them. Yeah. I mean, you also have the option just to not wear deodorant. Oh, gross. Uh, <laughs> I'm kidding. Like, uh, but, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, what I, you know, going back to Axe Body Spray, though. I always wear t-shirts anyway. So. Yeah, me too. That's what, these, that's these what it is. T-shirts, I don't, man, come yeah. on. Um, Walmart. I used to wear Axe Body Spray when it first came out, but I, I, I've always worn the same cologne. And I found an Axe Body Spray that smelled similarly to my cologne. Mm -hmm. So I would, like... Take, I would like put the cologne on in the morning, and then, like, if I went to the gym or so, I'd have like Axe body spray in my gym bag to like freshen up a little bit after the gym or like whatever. What do you wear? Cool water. You still wearing cool water? Yeah, dude, I'm out the Yo, streets. Yo, Jonas. See, this is one of those opportunities where you just walked in with that wayfish boy. <laughs> and I feel like we gotta have a talk. Dude, I have had numerous ladies be like, Oh, you smell good. What's that? Yo. You don't you, you don't feel like it's time to make a change. I, I like it, dude. For once it, smell, in it, your makes, it, it life. works good with my body chemistry. It smells good on me. You know, like it, every cologne smells different on different people. Yeah, it smells. I've had, dude, my whole life. Even like when I worked at like a video store, like customers that would be like, "Oh, wow, you smell good. What is that?" But like, you don't. You don't smell like seventeen-year-old you anymore. Yeah, but people still are complimenting me okay. on how I smell. I look, dude, you wear whatever you want. Well, no, sir. but like if people didn't compliment me, I would absolutely change. Like, but, but you wait. Now that's a false. That's a false parallel because you're basically saying, well, people say they like it, so why would I try something new? People may say that they like something new even more than they like what oh, you're already yeah. receiving. Like the instead for. of getting a compliment every so often, I may get them every day. Yeah, oh. you might not be able to keep. You don't realize that there's an upper echelon. It's like you're stuck in Ashtabula. Oh my god! So it's like, <laughs> oh my god! You you're opened like, my dude, eyes. I got a good job. I down did my polo sport a few times. Okay, that, that, and I liked how that smelled. Oh, that's it smells similar too. to Cool Otter, though. It really does. Man, look, Jonas, you're making bank now. It's time to start getting into bank. Some yes, I'm. I'm pulling in them figures. It is five time. figures solid. <laughs> Every two, three months. It's time, to, <laughs> it's time to start. Getting them upper echelon smells. It's time to start looking at some designer scents, man. 
There's All a right. reason. Well, once the pandemic's over, I'll do it. I, I ain't ordering anything on the internet right now. We can, we're not talking about that. <laughs> I'm not. No, I, I, that was just like an actual statement of like, I'm not ordering new cologne right now. Well, I don't know why you wouldn't, man. It's probably cheap. I don't know where it's coming from, dude. Freaking the, uh, what do you call that? The Amazon store. Yeah, what if, what if they're all just like, hit, hit, hit all over my cologne? You ain't say that when you got them two cases of freaking Rockstar in the kitchen over I there. I need that. <laughs> I need that rock star. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know. <laughs> I need that. P.S. Public service announcement: You can buy full cases of rock star online, way cheaper than you can get them in the store. So, if you drink rock stars, people are like, "Who drinks?" Rockstar? I know. But uh, anyway, oh, I forgot to tell you. I almost sent you a thing. Rock star has been bought by Pepsi now, so basically, it's really? gonna be trash soon. Yeah. What do you mean it's going to be trash? Because any anytime a major company like that buys something, they're going to change it, dude. So all the flavors that you like are going to go away. They're going to do their own thing with it. It's and when it comes to energy drinks, I really like would never drink them until I I moved in here. And it was just like it's like having a roommate who smokes. You just like oh, I'll have a cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> and I was just like hey, I'll have an energy drink. Oh, I was whatever, like, dude, like I'm like this bad influence. I'm not saying you're a bad influence. It was definitely my job in working mornings where I have to drink coffee every morning. Yeah, where I got the more the taste for the caffeine, and then it was just like this tastes better than coffee, yeah, and it doesn't great. make me poop all the time. <laughs> <laughs> well, now you don't have a healthy GI tract. <laughs> exactly. But uh, I, I don't know. I like those bangs, too, but they're just, like, so much more expensive. Yeah, they're, like, two bucks a piece. They're crazy. Some of their flavors are really weird, dude. Like, they're too yeah. much. Like, I tried one. At, like, the one I really like is cherry limeade. That's pretty good. That one's all right. But even if I, once I've had, like, three of them, I'm like, okay. It's yeah. Like, and then uh, what other one did I try? It was, like, an orange a citrus something. And I was like, this isn't very good. I had the peach mango the other day and an apple, the apple crisp one. Yeah. The, the apple crisp is trash, dude. Yeah, dude. Well, like, what was that one? Unicorn poop or something? Tasted yeah. like cake. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> what the F is this? No, I kind of like. Like, lot, like they've cornered a market. They have unique flavor energy drinks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're fancy. They're funny names. They're called Bang. Like they have their whole, whole like shtick. I get it. Like it's, Jonas, we should do an energy drink review for the channel, dude. Oh, should we? I, yeah. I, mean, I drink them, so my go if, out if we get, could get him to send us some for free, I would absolutely review. That it. would be great. But we can go out and get like base base flavor Bang, base flavor Rockstar, base flavor M4. I don't know if. I don't know if Bang has a base flavor. They gotta have like a, a Ryu of their. <laughs> <laughs> what is the Ken of uh, of what's Bang? The, yeah, please? what's the Ryu and Ken of Bang? Yeah, there's always two. There's like the the the. Sh but I wouldn't want to drink the sugar ones, dude. I can't. Yeah, I, I can't. I'd have to do all sugar free, or at least even if you notice those new rock stars we got are different. Yeah, now, I see now they have ten calories and more caffeine. Where they used to be zero calorie and they were like two hundred milligrams of caffeine, zero calorie. Now they're two forty. And ten, yeah, I shot you. Two forty, yeah. I saw that you had one. Do they taste different? I haven't had one yet. I still have the old ones. Oh, I mean, it's negligible if there's a difference whatsoever. But I did notice that the packaging was different. Yeah, right? yeah. It's all like it's like more like gunslinger. It's like <laughs> it. punched. It's like Mountain Dew. You know the Rockstar has a Ryu. What's the Ryu of Rockstar? The black can. The black can. That's the sugar one. The white one is the uh, is the sugar free. Oh, it's just original flavor. It kind of tastes like. See, and I always think of the white can too. Well, oh, yeah. So that's well, the can and re. Yeah, it is. It's the black and the it's the sugar and the non sugar. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, it is. It's. I, yeah. I, it's like I want to say I like it, but I want to say yeah. I don't. Yeah, it's, it's, like, it's it a little bit of both. Like, it kind of reminds me of carbonated Pez in a weird way. Yeah. And I'm like, is this, but like what, I can't tell what flavor Pez it is. <laughs> exactly. It's, it's not, not good. <laughs> it's just not good. Right. Like I'll get one every once in a while and I'll be like, this ain't bad. And then by the end of it, I'm like, do I want one of those again? Like no. every time, like the first like half is good. The second half yeah. is bad. It's like, yeah, it's not, not good. Right. But it's not, I would not, but it's not a case good. Of it. Yeah, it's not good. It's but like it's like the not sour not apple good. rock star. Like I would like I, I drink one the first few drinks, I'm like, God, this is pretty good. And then I get halfway through it and I'm like Yeah. I like I don't really even want to finish it. That's this. how I felt at the end of that sour apple crisp bang or whatever it was. I was like, Oh yeah, like, right? this is not good. Yeah, dude. I like energy drinks. They're interesting. They don't give me energy though. That's probably because I have undiagnosed ADHD. <laughs> so <laughs> anyways.
that is all time we have for today's episode. <laughs> Speak your truth. <laughs> Please make sure to like and subscribe. Uh, if you're, uh, yeah, whatever. So <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever. Great <laughs> intro. Ba- basically, wash them hands for <laughs> and, and your balls. For, for Jonas. <laughs> TNT Dynamo. We are out. <laughs>